Right fellas, I'm going to be showing you how to get the normal Pack-a-Punch open and the Golden Pack-a-Punch. So firstly, you want to turn on the power. One spawn location is in the spawn area right here. And a second spawn location is in the normal Call of the Dead location at the top of the ship. Follow the route I take here, go up the stairs and through the doors here. This is where the uh, power switch is, boom, turn it on. So next we're going to go pick up a gearbox and the gearbox is just down from the second power location that you just turned on. Here it is near the flipper machine that can park all you across the map. So pick up the gearbox and now we're going to go find a crank. So follow the route I take here on this same ship, go down the stairs and you want to buy the debris here. There's three spawn locations for the crank and one is here. You can see it on my screen. A second spawn location is just around the corner on the wall here. And a third spawn location is inside near this big box here. So once you've got the crank you want to go back up the stairs to the top of the ship. And you can see this box here. You want to put the crank on that and hold square to rotate the crank. You want to keep it held down for about 10 seconds and you've done it. So now we're going to go find one more crank. And this spawn location for the crank is at the back of the ship. So you want to follow the route I take here. Keep on buying the debris. Jump down here. And you want to be on the main deck or the forecastle area. So here we go for the second crank. You want to follow the route I take here. And to the right is where the crank can spawn. A second spawn location is down here. You want to follow the route I take here. And it's going to be near this container on the wall here. You can see it's there in my game so you can pick it up. And a third spawn location for the second crank is towards the proper back of the ship. Right up back at ship and you can, you can see it here. It's going to be right there on the wall. So now you want to go take the crank to another box and you can rotate the crank. So the, the box is here in the main deck location. You want to press square to rotate and hold down the crank. Keep it held down for another 10 seconds and you've bossed it fellas. So now you want to go towards the lighthouse approach area. This is the slope up towards the lighthouse. And it's going to be a blue rock spawn location and there's three spawn locations in a very small area. So one spawn location for the blue rock is here on the wall. You can see where I'm pointing my gun. A second spawn location is to the right here. And all you do is shoot it or melee it and it's going to fall to the ground and you pick up the blue rock. And the third spawn location is here just opposite it. Very easy to find is this one. Just shoot it and pick it up. So now you want to go up to the top of the lighthouse and... If you've done all the steps I've shown you, it's going to drop down a pallet is this guy who's at the top of the lighthouse and you can pick up this zip line handle. So this is going to go towards the golden packer punch. So pick that up if he drops it down on the pallet. And then you want to wait maybe 30 seconds and he's going to drop down the pallet again on some rope. And all you're going to do is place your gear box onto the pallet. He's going to take it up. And then he's either going to drop down the pallet again so you can put your blue rock on it. Or he's going to drop down the gearbox that you've just put up. He's fixed it. So if you see the gearbox, pick it up. And then finally you want to put your blue rock on there. So when you put the blue rock on the pallet to take up to the top of the lighthouse to that random up there. That means that Packer Punched is open. And to make sure it is open, you can see from the top of the lighthouse, you can see a blue light beaming down onto the map. And basically, this blue light moves maybe every round or so, from what I can remember in Call of the Dead. So just follow the blue light, and you'll find Pack-a-Punch. So on to the last bit of the golden Pack-a-Punch now, and you've got your zipline handle that the guy has gave you from the pallet. And you've also got the fixed gearbox that you've sent up to Aladdin Lighthouse, and he sent it back down. So what you're going to do is use that zipline handle... And you're going to go to this new area of the map. So press square to zip line upwards if that's possible. And you're going to come to this new area of the map. So up here we need to turn on one more power switch. So you want to follow the route I take here. You're going to need some points to open doors. So here is the route fellas from the lighthouse. You can go up the stairs. You're going to park off through all the, uh, all the areas and the buildings. You want to follow the route. Go through this door. And then you can see this massive square area with all the machines in and stuff. You just want to follow the route I take, go down the stairs, and it's going to be right here as a power switch. You can see it here, and all you do is press square to turn it on. And that's turned on the lighthouse for the uh, randomer up the top. I don't know what it's called, don't know what he's doing, but he's, just, he's having a good time, isn't he? So once you've turned on the power switch in this new area, 
you want to zip line back down and you want to place your gearbox back where you picked it up so I'm going to show you where that is here just press square on the flipper parkour pad thing here and then now you can go to the golden pack a bunch area so the location of the flipper pad that takes you to the golden pack a punch is just up here near the second power switch here it is just step on it for about five seconds and it's going to fling you to the little island and there's going to be loads of zombies spawning i think there's a endless wave of zombies which is always nice um, but there it is golden pack a punch pretty cool so it'll max your weapons pack a punch them to epicness and also one very important thing fellas is you can only go back to the golden pack a punch island when the lighthouse is beaming the color gold so you might go up to the flipper and it's not going to work and you can't get to the golden pack a punch that means that the lighthouse is probably beaming blue which means a normal pack of punch is out. So when the lighthouse is beaming gold, that means you can get on that flipper and go to the golden pack of punch island. And um, yeah, 5,000 again to pack a punch that. And if you want to get off the island, just go where I went in my game. You can see this little flipper. It's going to flick, flick you. It's going to flip you back to the main area of the map. And that is the normal pack of punch and golden pack of punch opened.